My name's Sam, and we are back here in Strange View with Angela and Tank. Uh, Tank is, I, I, I think when we left off last, Tank was supposed to be at work. He's here, <laughs> jumping in a puddle. Uh, I did, I will be, I won't talk about it too much because it's like, anybody who knows my videos knows I change things around all the time. But I did try out uh, reinstalling story progression mod. I don't have it enabled in this hood. I installed it because of uh, some of the hoods we, that well, one of the hoods we play on stream uh, on my Twitch channel uh, that we've been playing early Strange Town on stream. Um, I do upload the VODs here. So uh, feel free to check that out. Maybe I'll have, maybe I'll be smart enough to put in a little link or something on screen. Uh, Angela, okay, there's a situation happening. But anyway, part of that mod does have like a time sink and things like that going on. So I don't know if it looks like he actually is supposedly has today off. But I swear he didn't. Maybe I'm mistaken. It doesn't matter. We're gonna play the we're gonna play this household till the season changes. Um I wish this didn't take so long. He's screaming. Actually, you know what? Tank's literally here. Hold the child. Is he what is Lyle's situation? He needs to go to the bathroom. I'm gonna have Tank potty train him, probably. Yeah, so last time, uh Oh my gosh, his screaming is like giving me a headache. <laughs> I'm not into it. Here, come potty train. So yeah, so we have, I love how the baby like almost perfectly matches Angela's sweatshirt. That's kind of fun. Okay, since this one's happy, put it in the crib properly. Who are you holding? I don't even know who you're holding. Daphne. I'll have to remember Daphne has the purple on. Um, so yeah, so we had quite a lot going on in this little household. A lot of, lot of uh, possibility with romance and such. I wasn't able to quite figure out why uh, Tank... Oh, that's right. You know what? I did... I mean, not Tank. Rip. Tank's brother, Rip, was identified as a family member for for Angela. I did take out one mod that I think was causing it, maybe? Because I also see here we don't have, like, the family identifier. Like, Coral has the family thing, because obviously that's her grandma. I don't see it on him. Hopefully it's going to work. Maybe we can uh, invite... Tank, I mean, Rip, oh my gosh, I keep calling him Tank. I'm not awake right now, it seems like. I, I, I feel like I'm tired and I don't know why. <laughs> it's it's currently 6 p.m. Oh, you're gonna bathe him? Sure, you know what? I forgot that they can bathe the babies like this. I always forget this. I'm gonna wash, wash a rub-a-dub-dub, the -dub, little child in the sink. Mr. Mr. Tank here wants to be friends with Daniel. He doesn't have a ton of, like, great wants for... Things. Oh, I also got them a car because at, the, at first I thought Tank still had to go to work and I thought maybe if I got him a car it'll let me, but it didn't. <laughs> so I just bought him a car for no reason. <laughs> I feel like maybe more of my sims should have cars anyway. It feels like they it would make sense for them to have some. I'm gonna have him just call up Daniel, I guess, and be friends with Daniel. All right, he's talking with Mr. Daniel for a while. Um, I don't know what to do with Ms. Angela. I guess I might... I might take her to a community lot. Maybe she needs to get away from the, the family. Maybe Tank has agreed to watch the kids while she goes on a walk. <laughs> a a non-suspicious walk. Maybe she's going to go for a walk to the grocery store that I never visit in this town. I haven't even gone to the grocery store in a million years and I literally made it. Uh, maybe we'll go for a walk. We'll, we'll use an excuse. What's the food level at in the here? Actually, you got to clean that up. Oh, check food supplies. Yeah, maybe she'll go for a little wander. And maybe when she's there, does she have a cell phone? She doesn't. I feel like she could have one. I could give her one. Or I can just use something else. I don't know, where can I buy a cell phone? I'm trying to think where I have a cell phone. Is 89. Current food level is 89. I assume that's out of a... Oh, total capacity is 200. Okay. Oh, well, now you're going to make something? Okay. Maybe today's not the day that she goes on an adventure. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, he got he got friends with Daniel. That's good. He wants to be BFFs. He's a, he's a popularity sim, so he has lots of wants like that. Oh, look at these very nice chopsticks. Not chopsticks. Oh my god. Look at these very nice pork chops. I'm gonna have you eat and take a break with from talking to your your father-in-law. Oh wow, we've got okay. Lyle's two days away. Daphne is a day, and Dallas is a day. Interesting. That means there's gonna be a period of time where we have three toddlers wandering this this lot this tiny little trailer that seems criminal we have oh, we have some money to spend on paying back our loan 
Do another 250, I guess. I'm just kind of doing some maintenance tonight. It's just some Sims maintenance. I'm gonna bathe Lyle. He's filthy. Oh, you're gonna go out and... Oh, he was about to... Look, look through the telescope on his own. <laughs> you know what, Tank? The last thing we freaking need in this household is you getting alien pregnant. Please, save us save us the trouble. Okie dokie. It is now 6 a.m. And oh, I guess you're going to take care of... Oh, no, you're going to take care of that one. I need you to take care of this one, buddy. Uh, Angela does have the day off today, which is good. That's pretty good. Um, what am I looking at? Here we go. Yeah, she has the day off. Tomorrow they both work though. We're gonna have to hire a nanny. I don't know. I'm afraid they're not gonna be able to afford a nanny. <laughs> I'm not sure. You're gonna serve something? Can you okay, you're just gonna get a snack. You know what? That's fine, buddy. You can do that. Oh, Tank's gonna be at work soon. Okay, he's just putting it down. He's gonna drive to work in his old jalopy, his little beat up jalopy here. Well, there he goes. He's all gone and we don't have to worry about him. Oh my gosh, look at her, look at her lawn with these disgusting, oh my god. Angela, Angela, why are you becoming this, this trailer park mommy? She's turning into a white trash trailer park mommy. Look at this lawn. Um, who should we call over? She wants to ask a sim on a date. We could do a dust and broke situation. Uh, we could also do a, I really want to try and start a rip grunt drama. We need to call sim. Let's see if rip wants to come on over. <laughs> Mr. Rip Grunt. Fight over. I did go around and finish giving some of the household makeover, so I think Rip has a little bit different hair and outfit on. Uh, he's looking very slick. He's looking very much like himself, I would say. What do you think? What do you think she's telling Rip to get him over here? <laughs> what is the... What is... Is she just... Is Does he... Is he understand fully what's happening, or is it just like a... We can... I, I need your help... There's a lot of children here. I need somebody to help out. Your brother said you'd come by. <laughs> Look at this outfit, Rip. I don't know. I don't know, Rip. I don't know about this. I literally put you in this outfit, but be I, I put him in this outfit because it looks silly. <laughs> it looks like something he thinks would be cool. I feel like that's where we're at. Okay, you can put away the juice just for a moment and greet this man. Okay. He's hungry. I guess he'll come in for a minute. Damn it, we still have only family kiss as an option. Okay, let's gossip. Somebody told me that I can use this. Doesn't tell me that I can remove family ties with Rip. That's so frustrating. Yeah, doesn't let me do that. That's so weird. I definitely took out the mod and everything. Um, huh. I guess we're gonna just have to call uh, Dustin over. This is That's a bummer. Alright, let's call our boy. Mr. Dustin broke. Come on over. This girl is just inviting all the all the boys over. Can my friend come over too? Yeah, sure. Why not? I wonder who is this going to be a full house? <laughs> Who's your friend, Dustin? What if he brings his dad? I feel like he's going to bring Skip over. It's going to get weird. Who are you? You're not anybody. Uh oh, this rips like I don't know what to do. Is he going to actually feed him a bottle for us? Actually, wait, I think he's going to do it. That'd be helpful. Rip's actually helping with the children. <laughs> we weren't even kidding. Like, he's actually going to come help with the children. That's good. There we go. Hold on, Lyle. Don't stay stay here. Oh, yeah, he literally brought his dad. This is Skip Broke in his new little outfit I gave him. Um, Sure. What if she ends up attracted to Skip also? What if, what if we end up with a weird... Family triangle that is that sh that's a little bit questionable. Oh no, <laughs> Skip's literally swooning her right now. I like they're gonna automatically start ACRing because they're just so into each other. What are you doing, bud? Listen to dirty joke. Yeah, I wish I wish I could figure out this situation. It's unfortunate. It's all right though. We we got plenty of other fish in the sea. All right, not these three just be- oh, oh no. Oh my gosh, dude, look at Rip. Rip's like, I just saw that. Oh no. He's cheating on my brother. <laughs> this this shot. Wait, I need a picture of this little scene. That's so funny. He knows. He's embarrassed. He has a little piece of gossip. He knows. Rip knows. Rip, you're- a, you're- a, look at you. What are you- why is he standing like that? <laughs> Rip, can you- He's thinking about Angela. 
You know darn well if the game would have let you, you would have been going nuts on Angela. What are these two doing? Play and catch. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Meanwhile, these two boys are taking care of the children. <laughs> skip and skip and rip. Oh my god, wait. Skip and rip. Oh my god. They're perfect. They're they're best buddies. I think what I might do is wait for wait for Tank to actually be home. Maybe by the time Tank's home, I'll have these folks all leave. What time does Tank get home? Oh, Tank wants a promotion. I'm going to lock that in. We're going to do that. Uh, 3 p.m. is when he gets home, so he's not going to he's going to be home for a little in a little bit. Rip's being a very good little uncle right now. I'm going to have them go ahead and go home. And then I think I'm going to have Angela like meet up with Dustin on a lot privately. They can have just a private actual date. It feels weird for them to have a date here together at the at the trailer with all these family members here even though they're obviously flirting in in you know but <laughs> they'll go somewhere else maybe i don't know where but they'll go somewhere okay every actually um we're gonna say goodbye to everyone because tank's about to be home let's see if we can get them all gone before tank shows up you there we go can we make it happen it's 256 not the kiss goodbye. Oh my god. These two boys know too much. <laughs> they know a dangerous amount of information. Oh, not Buck. Wait, Buck's walking by. <laughs> Look at Buck. <laughs> by the way, I gave Buck a good makeover. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Look at his mullet. This is Buck. He actually lives in town, but he doesn't particularly like his brother. So I don't think I think that's why he's doesn't come by too often. <laughs> Not Tank seeing all these boys just leaving. Oh, we got a promotion. He doesn't care. He got a promotion. What is he doing? He's going to go sleep. He's tired. Oh my gosh. Yeah, he got promoted to head of construction. Very nice. He's so tired. He wants to invite someone over. Maybe, maybe da Daniel. Maybe while he's sleeping, <laughs> Angela's going to be a little bit reckless and go sneak out. Here, let's go to... We're going to go bowling in downtown. That's going to be our little... She's, she needs to get out away downtown. Actually, you know, damn it. I should have... Wait, we're going to stop that. I'm going to have her take the car. Okay. <laughs> Angela has pulled back in because when I visited the symbol lot, the game crashed. And we have just loaded back. Luckily, I saved right before we left. This girlie's hair is broken, which is really fun. Um, anyway... So I think I might want to experiment with walking to a to visit a lot and we're going to go visit Dustin instead. Let's go to the house. Let's just see what that does. See if the game wants to allow me to do that instead. Because I don't feel like reloading the game again. Excuse me, old lady. We have places to go. There's a skunk in our lawn. Goodbye, skunk. All right, I've never really used the Visit Sims mod, I don't think. I'm curious how this goes, how this feels. Um, this is one of the story progression features that I I'm, I'm kind of wanted to have it in the game for. Um, okay, we're at the trailer here. So we have Mr. Skip and Dustin living together here. Let's just dive right in. Ask on date. Am I, I'm allowed to just walk on in. I don't have to knock on the door or anything. Oh, wait, I can ring doorbell. Oh, wait, let me ring doorbell. Oh, my God, look at this. Is it, oh, he's going to greet us. Skip, Skip knows too much. Skip's got too much, too much gossip hidden in his little, his little brain. Now we can go in. Ooh, very nice. Okay. Ask on date. Boom. We're going to have a little, little trailer park date. All by our lonesome. Skip's just going to leave us alone. There we go. A successful date. Has she made, she wants to make out with three different Sims. I wonder if she has, she must have made out with Dustin. No, she would have probably. What's this? Made out with Tank. Made out with Dustin. Yeah, she has already, but that's okay. Let's tickle, ma'am. Angela going right to that, that good old uh, arcade game here. Arcade machine. Ooh, Dustin has a want to have three first dates. That's, a, I'm not, why have I never seen that want before? Is that because he's like a pleasure sim? I think he might be secondary pleasure. I'm just going to have a chill little date, I guess. It's not quite the drama I wanted with Rip, but that's okay. At least we already got this going on. Maybe she'll find somebody new also. Oh, she wants to make out with the mans. 
I think I'm gonna unlock make out with three different sims. I don't really care that much about it right now. We're just gonna let things roll. We'll see what happens. I'm not sure that I want to dedicate too hardcore to her just like, I don't know. I mean, I think it'd be fun for her to be kind of like her dad and, and have all kinds of affairs. She does want to woohoo with the man. Um, casual. Let's go woohoo in the bed. Yeah, he wants to woohoo with her. <laughs> there we go. Woohooing in uh, the old bed. Why is it so dark in this room? Turn on this light. Look at that. <laughs> Skip's just kind of in the kitchen. Try not to interrupt. <laughs> He's just like, oh, all right, son. Whatever you, you want, son. It's kind of an interesting dynamic to think about that because Angela and Dustin have been longtime lovers since since their younger years. And here they are still very interested in, in pursuing a relationship, but yet Angela seems to think that Tank is more worthy of being the husband, that the provider. I guess that kind of seems correct, where Dustin maybe is less responsible. But he's just a little fling on the side. It's kind of interesting. Can we get to it here? Oh, oh I guess they haven't actually woohooed yet. Oh, not that just the pixel screen. Well, all right then. That was a good old time. Imagine if we have a little little Dustin baby. Okay, now we have three woohoos. See, I'm kind of more interested in the three woohoos than having to make out with three people. I mean, it's going to happen either way if we do the woohoos, but you know. Dustin, excuse us, we're on the toilet? All right, I guess they're so comfortable with each other that this is what's happening. <laughs> this is what's taking place. I still want to interact. He's going to take a shower. Um... Their d date might right, might run out before we get done here, but I'll let them do their thing for a minute. All right, we've continued back in the same old room. It's back in the day. Okay, now she wants to do a kiss. We're going to do another little makeout moment. Oh, what are we doing? Oh, back rubs. She's getting kind of hungry. Probably going to wrap the game there. Uh, we're going to wrap up the date soon. All right. They're not at dream date. She does want to get a dream date, but it is late, and I'm sure that Tank is concerned. So I think she's going to end date. Uh, where did it go? Right here. Yeah, you're a great date, baby. All right. Once again, kissing in this old, this old room. All right, we're going to go back home, Angela. You had your little, little fix. You had your romance sim fix. All right. <laughs> Yeah, she, she got her little fix. I think she's very much like her father, unfortunately. I believe she's developing into a miniature Daniel. Uh, it seems, it seems. All right, Angela has returned home. The babies are... I hear babies screaming. What are all your wants, buddy? You want to buy stuff? He wants to buy a massage table? Oh my god, you have all these wants for things. Also, it seems that our season has changed over. Um, I think that story progression caused the season to sync up a little bit different than where we were at because i think we were halfway but it bumped us forward a little bit uh so i'm gonna just play for a little bit longer we're gonna play for like another day or so until i get to my usual recording time i'm not i'm not quite there yet so we're just gonna keep going for a little bit so we don't have just a short little boring episode oh my gosh it's very messy in this house we need to do some cleaning there's like 30 bottles everywhere <laughs> This, this room's routing is rough. This we're, They're going to need an upgrade real soon. They're going to have to tack on to that loan. Oh no, look at this, <laughs> this mess. All right, Angela, you clean up this mess. Oh, she's very hungry. I forgot about that. You know what? She can cook. Ooh, actually, we've got some good money to put. Speaking of our little loan, I don't know. I don't want to do a thousand at once, but maybe, you know what? I'll do a thousand just to get it taken care of. I'm going to let them keep the 700. Speaking of which, should we check... Get the mail. See what's going on in the mail, mister. 1 a.m., but you know what? Let's let's check some mail. Damn, Angela's really enjoying the pork chops? Made herself even more pork chops? Oh, well, the bills were only $99. You know what? I think Tank's had enough, and I think he's going to dispose of these. I think we need to clean up this mess, Tank. If Angela's not going to do it, we can. All right. I'm going to actually have her sleep. That should be good. Oh, God, she has to... Oh, that's right. <gasps> I forgot. They have to... Some Somebody's got to hire a nanny. Oops. What is it? Service? Call service. Sir, I need you to get out of the bathtub. Because he's... Yeah, even though he got a promotion, he still has to work today. He, he works Monday to Friday. Um... I'm going to call nanny. 
Uh, track schedule. Oh, you gotta go to work, madam. Oh, she's, oh, she's running. She just woke up. She put on her sweatpants and ran. She hasn't been to work in a while, too. She's an aerobics instructor. She's got a ton of skills, too, from going to college, so she should have a pretty good time climbing the ladder. These two seem like they could climb the ladder pretty easily. Everything's quiet in the baby room right now. <laughs> and the, the babysitter is tracking Tank's schedule, so that'll be helpful. Oh, oh. Okay, Tank's going off to work. Oh, the babysitter just kicked her, kicked her, our flamingo. Excuse me, ma'am. Can I help you with something? You have a nice little outfit. Look at her go. Oh, disrespectful. Okay, Ms. Angela has returned. So the fun thing, oh, there we go. I was gonna say, she, she's, she was gonna get promoted so easily and there she goes, first time. Backup dancer. All right, Angela. So he's gone till 5 p.m. It's 3 p.m. I wonder if Angela might take a walk. The babysitter's still here, you know. She could go do whatever she wants. She could uh, take a little walk to a community lot. I can save my game in case it crashes. I'm just trying to figure out what the next step is. I was really hoping for a little uh, scandalous rip grunt affair. Unfortunately, that does not seem to be available to us at this moment. I think she's going to go for a walk. It's a nice spring day. She's going to go to the Strange Town pool and see what's up over there. See if she can scout out any Strange Town cuties. Excuse me, ma'am. We're on our way to Strange Town. All right, here we is. Here we is. Who's this? Kennedy Cox is here. Hello, Kennedy. All right, we got to we got to scope out. Maybe she's, you know, she's a, she's an athletic sim. Maybe her excuse is that she's here to practice her body skill. She's going to work out at the little gym here and kind of look out the window, see who's wandering by. We got Andrea Hogan in a little hula outfit, which I don't really know why she's in that outfit cuz she's just a regular townie. Um, then we got Kennedy Cox. Oh, we got Ms. Mary Sue, not Mary Sue, our mother showing up at the pool. <gasps> Who's this? Armando Cox. <laughs> There's a lot of Cox at the pool today. Uh, Orlando, whatever his name is. He's a teenager. Oh, Miss Crumplebottom has arrived, of course. I wonder if oh, Don Lothario has arrived. Interesting. Would, would Angela become involved in the notorious Don Lothario? Look at this suit. Why are you showing up at the pool in this Don? Uh, let's greet Don Lothario just casually. Casually dr greet the the man himself. I almost think Don is Don a secondary popularity sim, which I think she's a popularity with secondary romance. So it's kind of interesting. Now, obviously, Don is main mainly romance. Where did Donnie go? Where'd you go, Donnie boy? Where you, where you headed? This is interesting. He's like, oh, Angela, you have you have grown. <laughs> so so weird. Oh, he he enjoys Angela. All right. No, we're not going to dive. Oh, look at the chemistry. He has th she has three bolts with Don Lothario. Oh my gosh. Let's lay down a charm. Oh no. Is our mother in view distance? I don't see mommy. Where's mommy? Maybe in over here. I hope our mother doesn't see, doesn't start the, the gossip. Angela's going to be more careful. Not Don leaving. Wait, Don. Oh no, Don's leaving. He's like, this place is too dangerous for us, Angela. Not this time. Why did he just leave? Johnny, please. <sighs> well, we, we've planted a seed. I guess she's gonna she's gonna dive. I wonder if I could call Don back. I did a little little cheaty thing and gave Angela a cell phone. Maybe she. Could, what if I have her go somewhere else? Would she go to? Maybe she'll go back to Pleasant. Okay, let's just go to the cafe in Pleasant View. This is quite an adventure she's going on. I'm just going to go to a random lot. And then we're going to try and call Dawn. I just want to... I, I, I think that's a fun little interest... I can't talk. I think that's a fun little little moment. Possible interaction we could have. Let's go, Ms. Angela. Let's go. Oh, oh, interesting. Okay, we have arrived. Uh, we're loading in here. It's a little chonky. A little choppy. There we go. We've arrived at the cafe. We haven't been here in a while also. Um, 
we got a moment happening. My uh, invisible little default replacement here is having a moment. There we go. <laughs> I fixed it for right now. Uh, she wants to become friends with Don Lothario. I think we need to invite him on over. Oh, oh there he is. Hopefully he'll come over. Oh no, Don is out working. Okay, uh, hello Carmine. Uh, so here's the deal is we we know Don is not out working. Maybe actually, that's probably why Don left the lot so abruptly is it was time for him to go to work. <laughs> uh, well, here we are. Here we are. Angela's kind of striking out, but also she's either, it's almost like Angela wants to become a sophisticated romance sim, but all she can seem to catch is her 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 old trailer park boyfriend living in his same little little trailer park they're they're flirting and making out in that same old bedroom as when they were teenagers she can't seem to to grow up and mature past it she's she's struggling she has big dreams for her romance future there's a cat in here chewing a chair scratching a chair okay who else is wandering on in jenny smith is here interesting random old lady random dude Oh, Jill Smith is here. That's cute. Look at little Jill. I gave Jill a makeover too. I might have her just try call Don one more time just to see if we get lucky and he's uh, home from work. I don't know if he works all night. The other option is to call somebody else. Nope, <laughs> not Cassandra answering this time. Don is at work working. Okay, I think we've we've seen enough here. I think we are actually going to go go home was kind of a flop let's go home angela we could at least call don on the phone in the morning give it a try see what we can manage for a friendship once again sort of begin something all right we, we have arrived home i hear baby's crying okay tank is home from work uh he's probably been home for a few hours and is very confused as to where the hell his wife has been this whole time she did inter interestingly she did show back up in her work wear Maybe she's lied and told him that uh, she had to work overtime unexpectedly. Maybe that's the situation. Oh my gosh, this room is so crowded. I just had to manually move a baby out because <laughs> things were oh, like not out of the household, obviously, like over here. She's over here. She's fine. We're having some weird glitches with getting the babies out of the cribs. Uh, there we go. All right, I'm going to put this one away. I'm going to hold this one. Oh, no, he's going to hold that one. I thought they should be aging up pretty quick here. I was wondering if that might be our, our end is is when these babies age up. I think they're getting close, aren't they? What are you two doing? Oh, not you two doing this. Oh, my God. Y'all, we were just... Did you just see the situation we were having in the friggin... The friggin... The, the baby room? There's not enough room for more. You guys, please <laughs> listen to reason. <laughs> There's too many. There's too many. <laughs> well, Angela might. So this could be fun because it's like, is Angela pregnant with Dustin's baby? Or is she going to end up pregnant with Mr. Tank's baby? Good question. I don't know. Yeah, there they go. They're at it. They're going at it. Oh my gosh, the screaming. This is what you, this is what you want. You want more of this? Are you kidding me? Look at this mess. The stink line matches all the green decor in this house. <laughs> this is this is wrong. Oh my god, the babies are so red. Okay. I need you to, to hold the baby. Can you wake up? I'm gonna feed a bottle. And I don't know, I think I'm gonna manually age up these babies because I think they should have already aged up. I don't know if I'm just being impatient. But we're gonna probably wrap up this episode, so we're just gonna age up the babies. I don't think it's the end of the world if I just... Have it happen now. Let's have let's have you while you're holding this one. Um, you're he's holding Dallas, so we'll have baby Dallas age up. I tried to do some aging stuff, and it just keeps glitching on me, which is very frustrating. Uh, I deleted the toddler bed because they keep getting stuck around it. Oh crap! Now we don't have money for the other bed. You know what? That's fine. Whatever. I'm getting very frustrated with this household right now. Uh, I don't have the patience today, I'm gonna be honest. So we might end up calling the episode here. I kind of just want to see the toddlers. Maybe I'll wait just a little bit to see if we can figure it out. Oh, literally as I said that, he just aged up the baby. Okay, he just aged up this baby. Alright, Dallas just grew up to a toddler. Look at this dapper little outfit. I'm afraid... well... 
Does does this one look a lot like the first one, Lyle? I see definitely still a lot of tank, but maybe that's just the brown hair. Maybe he's got no. I don't think he has as much of a tank nose. Oh, there's a there's a friendship happening. Oh, what a what a pose that is. Okay, let me just look at this one's face real quick. No, definitely a different nose, and different freckles and stuff. Okay, we don't have like a a uh, duplicate baby situation. They are very unique. All right, this one's gonna age up soon too. Oh, there we go. Finally. After 30 years, we have, we have the first little girl of the household. She doesn't have the freckles. Both the boys got the freckles. I see a lot of tank. The brown hair obviously is becoming very strong in this household. We're losing the red hair, which is unfortunate. Um, but yeah, we've definitely... We, I, see it, I see a little bit of the tank nose, but she's definitely unique looking as well. That's very cute. Some very good little simmies we got going on here. Um, yeah, that's going to be it for this household. It was kind of a weird last few days of trying to make some things happen. I think maybe the story itself um, is that Angela is struggling to accept her her motherhood and is struggling to... She, she's a little lost. She thinks she wants to be a, a romance sim. She's getting the urge like her father. But she seems to also be a little bit having a hard time getting that going. So there's there's a little bit of turmoil in this household that I think is going to develop probably in the next more so in the next round. But I did enjoy this time. Who's out here? Who are you? Uh, Martin Rubin's here. Hello, Martin Rubin. Uh, why are you standing in our trash, Martin Rubin? Anyway, I just realized we don't have a car. Where did where did where did our car go? I feel like it's glitched because of Tank having. Tank was away at work with it while we left the lot. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm not gonna ask questions. I'm gonna hit save. We're gonna call this a night. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye.